Major Slack Attack. Yo, the name is Slack, and welcome back to Extreme Skyrim. No crafting, no buying and selling, no skill training, and playing on legendary difficulty. And um, we are completing the final league of the tour of the Book of Love. Find Fenric, and this will reward us with a much needed 15% magic resistance. Um, considering a lowly skeleton almost took us down with the the bottom of the barrel frostbite spell it like wasn't anything special and that's all it took yeah we have a uh, weak magic weak, weak magic resistance okay so Fenric is over that way let's leave trigger our horse there see what other trouble we can stir up on the way up what is going on here? Uh, I don't like the looks of this. Okay, let's just uh, let's just go around that. Yeah, I don't like the looks of that at all. That looks really dangerous. Something we don't want to mess with. Okay. How about a little stamina? Get to move on here. We go over the mountain here. There's a way that you can go over. Right here. Uh oh, what's this? I mean, I yeah, jeez. Damn, that was close. <laughs> yeah, just gonna paralyze you again. Just make sure you're under control here. Yeah. Do your roly poly thing. Don't go that. Dude, I hate when they do that. I have to paralyze him again. Uh oh. Hold up here. Some needs recharging. No, don't go roly poly. Stay there. Okay, good. Got him. Okay, good. <laughs> Excellent. I think that calls for Mr. Burns. Excellent. Thank you, Mr. Burns. There's Fenric right over there. Okay, we just have some deer and a couple mammoths off to the left there. Everything looks good. Okay, giants and mammoths, you don't mess with me, and I won't mess with you, okay? That's the agreement. Fenric, your wife is looking for you. Rookie, where is she? We're expected to fight there tomorrow. Let me take you to her. If she's come this far from home, it must be important. Lead on. I just need to report back to camp by sunrise. Okay, I fast tracked the dialogue because I didn't want anybody approaching me while... Uh, all right, so that's it. Back to Rookie. Fenry, you're alive. Of course I am. What brings you here? I had heard that Gukar's men were wiped out. I came to find you. But that battle isn't expected until tomorrow. Rookie, what's going on? I'm so confused. 
confused. What's happening? It doesn't matter. I'm here. We're together now. And we will be forever. And up to Lover's Heaven they go. And we can return to Dinya. Alright. Done and done. Actually, now that we're in the neighborhood, is there anything I want to dump off the College of Winter? Or rather, no, it looks good. I'm in the headquarters at uh, the Dark Brotherhood, and it looks good. They're going back there anyways. Shield's down there, Grim Fang. We're amongst civilians now. Blessings of Mara upon you. Dinya, I help the long dead lovers find each other. Your efforts carry the blessings of Mara with you. There you go. So the, the agent of Mara has been rewarded to us. Active effects. Resist magic. Agent of Mara. 15% magic resistance. So you add that on to the Lord's Stone, and we have now we now have 40% magic resistance. Ah, a little better. Okay, now we have a contract in Iverston. Let's go take care of that. You probably one shot him now. Which is great because you have to kill him uh, stealthily, otherwise you get a bounty. It is Narfi. This poor soul here. Okay, wait till we're hidden. And get some. Oh shit! Didn't kill him. That's because they don't have my archery gear on. I forgot. Okay. He's hoping to get a bounty. Find out soon enough, just walk up to a guard. Oh, they seem pretty calm. Good day, officer. Yeah, me too. <laughs> Thinking of joining up. Okay, so we're good. Um, let's go back to the DB Sanctuary. Get paid, and I want to get the Grand Staff of Repulsion. Why, Slack? Because we're going to take on a College of Winterhold quest under Sarthal, after which we'll gain access to the Archmage's quarters and we'll be able to <clears throat> appropriate a very important staff. This here, this is going to be great. And you know what I decided that I have uh, a little hitchhiker here. I never use this. Only when I'm going up against frostbite spiders, and that's that's only later, so we can dump that and save a little carry weight. Okay, so that's that. Um, let's get paid. But the night mother is mother to all. It is her voice we follow, her will. Would you dare risk disobedience? And surely punishment? Keep talking, little man, and we'll see who gets punished. Oh, be quiet, you great lumbering lapdog. <laughs> it's had a long journey. You can at least be civil. Mr. Cicero, I for one am delighted you and the Night Mother have arrived. Your presence here signals a welcome return to tradition. Oh, what a kind and wise wizard you are, sure to earn Our Lady's favor. You and the Night Mother are of course welcome here, Cicero. And you will be afforded the respect deserving of your position as Keeper. Understood, husband? Her. Oh, yes, yes, yes! Thank you, thank you, thank you! But make no mistake. 
I am the leader of this sanctuary. My word is law. Are we clear on that point? Oh, yes, mistress. Perfectly. You're the boss. Ah, there you are. Good. I was done speaking with that muttering fool anyway. We've got some business to discuss. Okay, do you have a contract for me? I do indeed. Alright. You must go to the city of Markarth and speak with the apothecary's assistant. You'll probably find her in the Hag's Cure. When the Hag's Cure, got it. The girl's been running her mouth. Wants an ex-lover killed. She's apparently performed the Black Sacrament. Oh, about the Black Sacrament. Her name is Muiri. Muiri. I need you to talk to her, set up the contract, and carry it out. Got it. Anything else? Just do whatever the contact wishes. Be professional, represent us well, and get the job done. Since it's your first contract, I'll let you keep whatever Muiri pays. She'll be generous, I'm sure. They always are. Alright. That happens as soon as you complete your first Dark Brotherhood contract. And then it unlocks this quest here. Morning never comes. Table that for a later date. We're definitely doing that. Um... Thing blamed on the mother? Nazir. <laughs> Brother. Narky is dead. Congratulations. You slaughtered an emaciated beggar in cold blood. You are truly an opponent to be feared. Here's your payment. <laughs> Did you have to put it like that? It was just business. Jeez. Go on now. I feel so dirty. I need to take a shower. Okay, so that's it. Um up to the College of Winterhold we go. We are ready. We have uh, the Grand Staff of Repulsion. And here come the authorities. Uh oh. Alright, let's do this. Yeah, Slack's been a bad boy. That helmet being called is so cool. <laughs> it's so badass. Okay, here we go. This is the College of Winterhold. Not just anyone is allowed inside. Those wishing to enter must show some degree of skill with magic. I can do that. A small test, if you will. I'll take your test. Excellent. The mage light spell is useful to any mage, not just Dang those it. specializing in alteration. Can you cast one on the seal on the ground? Why couldn't it have been the flame atronach spell? I already know the mage light spell. I look forward to it. Okay, now once again, I made this absolutely clear in the intro. Quest related purchases are permitted. The college is in I don't even have well, to buy anything from her though. I think you'll be a super I'll lead you across the bridge. Once you're inside, you'll want to speak with Mirabel Urban, our master. Mirabel, got it. Yeah, but let's say she um asked me to use a spell that I didn't have. At that point we'd have to purchase it for thirty gold. That's permitted. That's quest related. Okay, let's just fast track this whole thing. Mirabel, I was told to come see you. Well, I'll give you a brief tour and then we'll get you to your wonderful. Please follow me and don't wander off. Okay, and the first thing you should do is wander off into the Hall of the Elements. <laughs> and there's a little class with told here, I'll just fast track this too. This is pretty routine. Welcome, welcome. We were just beginning. In continuing with our theme of safety, we'll start with wards. Wards are protective spells that block magic. I'll teach you all a ward, and we'll see if you can successfully use it to block spells, all right? Would you mind helping me with a demonstration? Are you at all familiar with ward spells? I don't know any ward spells. Do you have that's one for right. me? I can teach you a very basic ward. One that's very good. Enough. Now, if you just stand right over there, I'll cast a spell at you, and you block it with the ward. 
Can't do. Here we go. Over there, please. Just opposite me. Wouldn't want anyone else in the way. Now, cast the ward spell and keep it up. Hold still. Excellent work. Well, I think this is an excellent start. I think perhaps we're ready to begin exploring some of the various applications of magic throughout history. The college has undertaken a fascinating excavation in the ruins of Sarthor nearby. It's an excellent learning opportunity. I suggest we meet there in a few hours and see what awaits us inside. That's all right. All for now. Thank you. Done and done. Now, at this point, the Archmage's quarters are still locked. You have to complete the next quest under Sarthol in order to unlock them. What's in there is lacking. What's in there is the Staff of Frost Atronach. This is going to be like, this is really going to up our game. Um, I just want to go in here and get some free soul gems. Not that we really need them, but... Uh... <clears throat> Because we have the black star just as a matter of convenience and there's also some free potions in here too okay one two three and these potions that's it now i hope you discovered sarthal earlier on when we were going up to discover the tower stone because this will lock in Sarthal at a lower level making it a lot easier to deal with look where the heck is everybody they're not here yet here we go it's the first time I beat Doltir here. Okay, Doltir, let's do this. I'm, I'm ready, let's go. All right. Please stay close to me while we're inside. It should be safe, but it's always better to be cautious. It's always encouraging to see the younger generations embracing education. All right. Come on, get the letter. Let's do this. Okay, here we go. I find it hard to believe this excavation was approved. You know, there might be gold somewhere in here. Sarthor was one of the earliest Nord settlements in Skyrim. The largest. Sacked by the elves in the infamous Night of Tears, not much is known about what happened to Sarthor. Fascinating. Not exciting opportunity for well. Are there any questions before we begin? No, nope, no more questions. What would you like me to do? Ah, yes. Hmm. Well, why don't you see if you can assist Arniel Gain? Can't do. He's one of our scholars here working on cataloging our finds. I expect he'd appreciate some help in locating any additional magical artifacts here in the ruins. Any enchanted items will do. The you now let's see. Got it. Okay, what assist Arniel Gain. This way and jump down here. What about across this little bridge here? And here is Arniel Gain. Well, certainly none of this will benefit my research. Doctor sent me to help you. What? Yep. Ah, yes, you. I remember you. You do? You're going to help? Yes. That's fine. Just, just don't make a mess of my work. I've only <laughs> looked through a portion of this section. You, uh. You can look around in the chambers just north of here. Try and be careful, all right? We don't want to damage anything. Yeah, thanks Until for the vote of confidence. <laughs> okay. Let's get some light on the subject. You may want to use either, either a torch or the candlelight spell if you have it. And you have to pick up three enchanted rings. One here. One of these we could use, too. In our melee build. Another enchanted ring here. You have to look very closely. Third one over here, right up against the wall there. And finally, an amulet from this little 
plaque here. And uh oh, I'm locked in. What Don't fear, help. Was that racket? Is everything all right? I'm trapped in here. How in the world did that happen? <laughs> You're not gonna ground me, are you? <laughs> I pulled an amulet off the wall. Really? That's just, yeah. Perhaps the amulet is important somehow. Is there some way you can use it? Okay. Um, all you have to do is just put on the amulet. He sounds like a father admonishing a child. You know, How did you do that? How did you get paint all over yourself? Um, the Sarthal amulet here. Put that on. Hook up your flame spell, and that's it. That's all it takes. And the wall. It must be connected to the amulet. Mm, how about that? Okay, now to start off with, we're going to go melee warrior. So, let's put on our melee gear, dwarven helm, da 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 da. Yep, it's all on. Okay. Well, this is highly unusual. And in Uh oh. Hold, mage, and listen well. Know that you have set in motion a chain of events that cannot be stopped. Judgment has not been passed, as you had no way of knowing. Judgment will be passed on your actions to come, and how you deal with the dangers ahead of you. Okay. This warning is passed to you because the Sigic Order believes in you. The Sigic Order. You, mage, and you alone have the potential to prevent disaster. Take great care and know that the Order is watching. Huh. I... I swear I felt something rather strange just then. You too, eh? What just happened? Well, I'm not sure. Some sort of ghost or apparition appeared. It spoke to me. I'm afraid I didn't see anything. You did. Can you tell me more about what you Some made you are. <laughs> it said something about danger ahead and the Sigic Order. The Sigic Order? Yeah. Are you quite sure about that? Uh huh. That's very odd. Why? And danger ahead? Yep. Why, that doesn't make any sense at all. The Sigics have no connection to these ruins, and no one's seen any of their order in a long time. Perhaps we should take a look inside these coffins. Do, do you think that's now, wise? Do be careful. <laughs> Who knows what we're going told to find. <laughs> Okay. All Let's right. go. Here we go. It's game on. Um, I had the wrong staff hooked up. The staff of Grand Repulsion should be number seven. There we go. Okay, get it ready. Get ready to rock. Staff this guy. Staff this guy. And a little bit of vegetable soup. And it's game on. Bad Draugr. Down you go. Okay, who's next? I got this, Toltir. <laughs> He's getting totally tag teamed here. <laughs> Ouch. Ow. Um, can we use this? Do we want to breathe underwater for 15 seconds? I can't think of any reason why that would be useful. What the hell? And what do you have on you? Jump change and jump loot. Can we continue on our own top tier? You're kind of getting in the way. Yeah. No? You want to accompany us for a little further? All right. Okay, same deal here. Four Draugrs are going to spawn. Let's hit them all with the st st blah, Staff of Gram Repulsion, which will send them running for 30 seconds, and then we can just, like, you know, take advantage of them. One. Two. Three. Should be a fourth one here. 
Okay. Twelve tears got it. Don't, don't run away. Don't run away. Some of you tears just stand here and take it like a man. Oh yeah, you want to do this? Uh oh, hold the hold up here. Yeah, even these low-level droggers. Yeah, we're still we still got a ways to go with our melee warrior. Okay, Mr. Fumblefingers, un. Uh, here we go. Yeah. Okay, this one should be more manageable. Gotcha. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. I've never seen anything like this in Nordic ruins before. Why just look at all these coffins? This bears closer inspection. I'd like to stay a while and examine this. Good, You're good. Up. I should press on. Okay. If you can find whatever this vision of yours mentions. Excellent. Go on ahead. I'll be sure and catch up with you before long. Okay. Ta ta now. See you in the funny papers. Fascinating. Okay, to continue, pull this chain here and the another chain on the other side. And we have finally lost Tolftir, and into Sarthal we go. Hey guys, real walkthroughs like these are an endangered species here on YouTube. For a complete lowdown on the YouTube video game walkthrough scene, check out my Patreon page and please consider making a donation to yours truly, Major Slack, to help keep real walkthroughs alive on YouTube. You can donate as little as $1. That's $1, that's all. That's all it takes, alright? Thanks a lot, really appreciate it.